All right, so we're going to give you some, like, rapid-fire questions. No right or wrong answers, obviously. Um, do you – so when you putt, do you putt with a line on the ball, or do you just sit it, set it and forget it? Like, what, what's your process there? No lines. I, I, no lines. I see it, clean ball, and, and then miss that putt. <laughs> <laughs> Same. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. What's a TV or movie character that you most relate to? Oh. I'd love to say something like Reacher, just because I man crush him so hard. Um, Hell yeah. <laughs> yeah, I think, uh, yeah, I, yeah, I think someone like that. I think someone like that. Um, Hell yeah. Yeah, mil very military, um, yeah. but also like family is the most important thing to me. Yeah, yeah. for sure. Love that. Um, yeah. Are you a blade or mallet putter guy? Mallet. Mallet, oh, okay. Yeah. The first mallet. The first mallet. Yeah, All right. yeah, I've used both. Um and I seem to fail a little bit less with a mallet. <laughs> yeah. That makes sense. <laughs> Do you have a, a go to golf ball, like any brand or, or model? Tailor made T P five all day. Yeah. 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 yeah I will try to not use anything else other than that. Okay. Cool. Yeah. What did you use anything before that? And the, was there like a moment where you were like, "Oh, I'm going to use this one from now on." So uh, for a while, I was a Strixon man. Um, okay. Mm -hmm. AD A triple three. Mm -hmm. Um, and then essentially, with uh, I got fitted for my irons, which are tailor made P seven seventies. Yeah. Cool. Based on that fit with the spin and that sort of stuff, it was like you need to be using a TP five or a TP five X. So from then, that's what I've been using. Yeah. Yeah. So it was just made up from there. So you're, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Um, uh, so if you weren't golfing, if you weren't having this uh, golf influencer life, what else would you be doing with your life or what would you want to be doing? Full time dad. Nice. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, a wholesome yeah, answer uh, to tie it up. Yeah. So having done some mad shit for 20 years. Uh, I think oh, I'm only 36, but I feel like I just now take advantage of the fact that I can just be at home with the family, the dogs, mm -hmm. you know, um, there's one here actually. And, Wait, yeah, you're 36? So, 36, yeah. Dude, I thought he was like, I thought you were like 30 at most. Really? Right, well, Dude. How about that? <laughs> <laughs> 58. All right, God, it makes sense. <laughs> um... <laughs> Okay, another rapid fire question because we're I'm thinking about it. Uh who's your who's your football team? Tottenham Hotspur. Okay, yeah. So actually I'm I'm a Man U fan. I have been for like yeah. 15 years. I mean, dog shit right now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. Actually, but, you're yeah. playing right now. You're playing right yeah. now. I'll tell you what the score is. Hold on. It's uh you are about to win 2-1. Yep. Cool. Love to see it. Yeah. We're, um, we're in, uh, so, I mean, up here really, we, uh, I, I wish, I wish America cared more about, you know, soccer. I, I like it's getting better, it is, but it is, yeah. we're not as bad as like we used to be, but we're the only, I feel like we're genuinely the only country in the world that just everybody else that's, it's the universal sport, right? Like that's, that's footy is the yeah, game yeah. and we're the only ones we're like, nah, um, we, we, we do shooty hoops or we, or we, <laughs> we play, we play stickball. Like I can't, yeah. ah, you know, what are NFL here though, right? It's, um, it's getting bigger gradually. Yeah. Yeah. I want to know your thoughts. Cause I'm, I don't really watch too much football, like as in soccer, but I've been getting into it a bit more. Obviously there's the, the show, welcome to Wrexham with mm -hmm. Ryan Reynolds and Rob McElhinney that bought uh, Wrexham. What, what's like the just the general thought of other people outside of Wales of that, like the celebrities buying into a team like that. Yeah. So if we're talking about the Rexon thing, I think that's incredible. Yeah. And, yeah. Um, so I've watched most of the series on Disney plus. Yeah. Um, and you can see that those two guys particularly like that they genuinely believe what right. it is they're doing. Right. Yeah. So if it's something like that, I'm all for it. I really am like to bring a team up and like give the people in that town there's opportunities that yeah. come from it you know it grows everyone else grows with it i think it's brilliant and then the flip side is you've got someone that might go into it as like to evade some tax or something you know right like, yeah right exactly. right it is what it is 
like if you're going to inject money for for the good of the club and its fans and like the town and stuff then great if you just want to throw some money out of it to to pull out later because you're like trying to dodge the tax man or something like that then yeah maybe you're a bit of a douche it's (laughs) it's cool watching it because i feel like Wrexham's kind of similar like we're in Syracuse New York which is a smaller city but it's mm-hmm. like it things here just kind of like revolve around the university and how their athletics do mm-hmm. and it's seeing yeah. the same type of thing with Wrexham where it's it's just similar with seeing that community engagement in mm-hmm. whatever sport it may be and their ath- athletic success yeah. but yep no, um, I think that, yeah definitely and like I say I, I think I think it's good for the community right it's, I mean if yeah. you can yeah. help everybody else involved then game on I, I'm I'm subscribed to uh, Ben Foster's YouTube page. So like when he oh. when he played for when he played for them, I was like, wait, what the hell? Like, this yeah, is like yeah. the greatest crossover <laughs> I've ever seen in my life. But yeah, so you might you, if you subscribe to his, then uh, I'm assuming you subscribe to Choose and Ands, right? Of course. Come on, <laughs> man. I mean, who doesn't? Yeah. So, <laughs> um, like, as you heard it, heard it here first, I haven't said it to anywhere else yet. But me and Jimmy Bullard are in talks to have something going on. Like soccer AM, Jimmy. Bullshit. Jimmy, Jimmy beautiful hair, Bullard. <laughs> He's uh, so just Bro. Uh, Christmas time. He sent me a voice note asking me to basically get it on and let's have a bash. So. Been a little bit of back and forth trying to sort because he's because he's gone in basically in the golf world in like the last year or even less than that because yeah um yeah. yeah he hasn't been doing it that I mean he's been playing but he's just finally like starting to put stuff out yeah so he was occasionally here dipping in and out of yeah, yeah. And, hands, and then now he's like a, he's a he's an integral part of it and they base the videos around him playing someone don't they so a little bit of back and forth with. with tubes and a little bit of back and forth with jimmy nothing set in stone and i mean i'm not about to like going on their channel or anything like that hopefully sure. down the line why not but i think first off get uh get a match against jimmy is what we've yeah. been talking about yeah and then hopefully if all goes well i will get something going from there because that would be huge yeah he's a he's a hilarious human being that dude yeah. it's just, oh my god and he's uh, yeah, a- I- I've got voice notes on here, him taking the piss out of my leg. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm sure you, you probably, yeah, you probably have that like morbid <laughs> sense of humor too. So, so. yeah, man, I'm, I'm army. Yeah. yeah I was going to say you have to, yeah, <laughs> yeah, you have to, I do. He's a little bit more reserved, but he'll say some out of pocket shit. Where yeah. I'm just like, yeah. yeah, that's yeah. awesome. <laughs> yeah. Um, cool. So, yeah, I know you were saying before you got your, your next surgery is coming up in April. And then I think you yeah. said in the video the other day you're down like probably six to eight weeks. But what what is like kind of your goal for the season after that once you get back to to golfing and uh yeah, so season starts? I think from from surgery on the eleventh of April, I'm hoping that I can be back on my leg by the like end of June, which means mm-hmm. I still have a good chunk of the summer to be getting as much in yeah. as possible. Um so I was hoping to qualify for the Simpson Cup. I don't know if you've heard about this. So no. that's like the disabled veterans version of the Ryder Cup. So it's UK okay, against cool. US. Oh, yeah. cool. Yeah, it's 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 that right. If you if you have a look on Instagram, just put the Simpson Cup. It's it's actually huge. Like it's it's a lot bigger than than like what people might think it is. Yeah. Um, so basically, I'm part of the. Uh, on course foundation which is you got on course foundation us and uk the guy mm. that founded it john simpson he was a golf uh, manager so he actually signed sevi he signed faldo this this dude's like big time I, yeah. met Ar- I met arnold palmer at bay hill like wow. through him mm. oh shit <laughs> that was a fucking cool day i've got a yeah like that. Somewhere <laughs> after um so basically, like they host this event every year. So it's our version of the Ryder Cup. And this year it's actually in New York. Oh. Yeah. We're about to New Wait, York. Wait, we're in New York. Uh, hold on. Let me find it. <laughs> I will find the uh, Dude. where the course is. So that's October. It... Okay. Um, I wonder if it's on like that... Beth Page Way or something. Yeah, because we're we're like so we're, we're central New York, so we can get pretty much anywhere. Yeah, in a we're couple like hours. we're like <clears throat> towards like more towards Canada, but like we're we're in like TJ said, we're in central New York, so like everything around us, we can pretty much get to within a couple hours. Exactly. It's not. Um, I mean, it's a lot closer for you to get than it is me, right? 
Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I would hope so. <laughs> oh man, where is it? I'll find it. I'll find it. Um, so like we've, I've got the qualifiers coming up and, um, the trouble is I don't think I'm going to be on my leg before I need to do doing these qualifiers. That's the problem. Mm, gotcha. Uh, where are we? Simpson cup. Come on. Where is it? Uh, I'll find it and I'll send it to you. Yeah. You're fine. I don't remember where it is. <laughs> You're fine. We can talk <laughs> about it after too. That's cool. That's that's dude. That's well, I mean, if all else, you know, if everything goes well and you get, and you make it, let us know. Cause that's, Dude, we'll go. I mean, we'll be the only Americans cheering, cheering for a European yeah, team. Yeah, they'll true. be like, "What the fuck is wrong with these guys?" How, how long you last there? It's a different story. Yeah. <laughs> nah, <laughs> most Americans are. I said most aren't. They're not too ruthless with that shit. <laughs> uh, yeah. So that 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 would be like the main goal. But um, cool. That I would be away, and I think if I remember in October that we would fly back home on the on my daughter's first birthday oh gotcha so like wow. if, if i qualify then we we all go mm -hmm. like the whole family go yeah, yeah. Wow. We'll, we'll, we'll make a thing of it yeah the whole family go and then that way like because as much as i want to play in the simpson cup and it's such a big deal to to qualify for it and be you know essentially our rider cup yeah i'm not willing to miss my daughter's first birthday for it hell no Good yeah. for you. you know you know like golf is huge to me and it's at the like epicenter of who i am now and like recovery and mental health and, and all of that but ultimately like it doesn't come before my family so yeah um for sure that would come, that. yeah she'd, she'd come first man I've, I've i've got some rights and wrongs from being away so often with the army over the years that i've missed cool no, good yeah. for you, man. That's awesome. Well, we really appreciate you taking the time to come on and, and talk yeah, with us. For, thank you for having me on. It's been mega. Yeah. Hell yeah, man. Real quick, just tell everyone where they can find you on socials and on YouTube and all that stuff so they can go find more oh, content yeah, so, from you. Uh, Rick Web Golf uh, across, the, across Insta, Facebook, TikTok. And then we've just rebranded our YouTube channel from Rick Web Golf to RJ Golf. Gotcha. RJ Golf. Okay. So RJ Golf, cool. Rick Web Golf. If you just put Rick Web in, I should come up. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Just underneath awesome. Rick Shields. <laughs> <laughs> cool. Well, we really appreciate you taking the time and, uh, you know, best of luck getting in the Simpson Thanks, Cup. Man. Looking. Hell yeah, man. Thanks yeah. for taking the piss out of us. See? I got it. Big time. Of course, yeah, man. Of course. Take care. So that was cool having Rick Webb on. Hell yeah. Hopefully, you know, best of luck to him qualifying for the Simpson Cup. Yeah. Hopefully, everything's all good here. Follow up his surgery and then. I uh, looked it up. It's going to be in Shinnecock Hills down in Long Island. So hopefully we can get down there and, and yeah. meet him if he gets over here with his family. And yeah, that'd be great. Get down there, at least meet the family, watch him play, root for a team that's, you know, visiting. But yeah, I'd do it. That's great. Yeah, that was going to be our best chance to to kind of collaborate with him. He's yeah. like the furthest away that we've collaborated with, being from England. But uh, mm -hmm. hopefully we get here uh Get over here to the States and we can do something. Yeah. So make sure you go follow his page, drop him a like, uh, follow, subscribe to his YouTube channel. Uh, he was telling us a lot that he's got some big things happening. So make sure that you keep an eye on that. So um, yeah, just thanks again, man. Cool. <laughs> thanks for watching today's episode. To see more of our content, be sure to follow us on Instagram, TikTok, and subscribe on YouTube. We can be found at Basic Bogies on all platforms. Thanks. We hope to see you on the next one.